Right, the second of our qualifiers in Newcastle is a mile three handicap, more to 80. First four make it into the finals. One is Bowman's Quest, Stu Gray, two Ridgewood, Craig Beckwith. Three Age of the Drunks, Joshua Sullen, four National Guard, Obi-Wan. Five Cathedral, Kensington, Darren French. Six is Bushrod, John Morgan. Uh, seven is Classic Mode, Alex Cherry. Eight, Lucia Fury, Patrick Hogan. Avalanche, Obi-Wan. Ruby Swirl, Alex Cherry. New Order, Graham Clutterbuck. Marie Antoinette, Kevin Meenigan. And Citizens Drum, Stu Gray. 13 horses in this qualifier. First four will make it to the finals in week 12. There at the start. And away they go at Newcastle with Marie Antoinette and a good break. But uh, Age of the Drunks is way better. And Age of the Drunks leads from Ruby Swirl on his inside. They're just they're followed by New Order back in third. And out wide is Bush Rod. They're followed just by Cathedral Kensington. Uh, he's wide of Stu Gray's horse, which is Citizen Drum. Uh, trying to improve is the Grey Horse National Guard. But it's Age of the Drunks who leads from Bush Rod in second. Then comes Age of the Drunks for the Cup National Guard for Obi One. It's Ruby Swirl. Alex Cherry's horse uh, behind that. In between horses. Is Citizen Drum for Stu Gray on the rail. He's a new order for Graham Clatterbuck. Then the yellow colours, the black cap of Patrick Huggins, Lucia Fury. Avalanche is between horses for Obi Wan. The white sees white cap with Ridgewood just on the outside of that. Then comes Marie Antoinette, who's on the outside of Bowman Quest. They're followed by a classic mode, who's just preceded by uh, Cathedral Kensington. That's about uh, 10 lengths first to last as Age of the Drunks takes him along. It's about two lengths clear of John Morgan's bush rod. In between horses, New Order, and that's white, uh, red, and green colours for Graham Clutterback. The grey horse on the outside is National Guard, and up on the inside of National Guard is Citizen Drum. Then it pushed along Ruby Swirl, with Avalanche just behind that for uh, Obi One. Then followed by Patrick Hogan's uh, Lucia Fury. He has been pushed along. Travelling well just behind that is Marie Antoinette, also starting to try and improve is the grey horse Cathedral Kensington. Then comes Craig Beckwith's Ridgewood on the road is Bowman's Quest and Classic Motor at the back of the field. They start to turn for home now. You had Newcastle and Age of the Drunks the leader from New Order in second who's travelling well. Then comes the Citizen Drum for Stu Gray. Trying to move forward is Marie Antoinette. Ruby Swirl behind it. The two Obi-Wan horses together. National Garden Avalanche. But it's Age of the Drugs in front from New Order in second. They're followed by Citizen Drum on the inside. Trying to move forward now is Ruby Swirl. Eight for Drugs with two points left to go. He's still travelling well. Ruby Swirl. He's looking a big threat for Alex Cherry. He's Age of the Drugs. Here comes Ruby Swirl. Also finishing strongly up the outside is a uh, classic mode. But Ruby Swirl picks it up with a very and a half to go. Ruby Swirl from Kensington, Cathedral Kensington, Classic Mode, also there, Avalanche and National Guard, but it's Ruby Swirl from Alex Cherry. Ruby Swirl now between horses is trying to flash out his Lucia Fury. Lucia Fury for Patrick Hogan picks it up, and Lucia Fury are going to go to winners from Classic Mode in second. They get New Order back in third, and Stu Gray's horse, Bowman's Quest, is back in fourth. Lucia Fury was pushed along for a long way but didn't finally get going and Lucia Fury wins for Patrick Hogan from classic mode who came from the back of the field for Alex Cherry in second then New Order was back in third and the one that looked like the winner fell in a hole with half a furlong to go um, was the Alex Cherry horse the second Alex Cherry horse which was Ruby Swall actually ended up finishing seventh but the winner Lucia Fury for Patrick Hogan classic mode second for Alex Cherry new order for Graham Tatterbuck finished third Bobbitt's Quest 2 where finished fourth those four qualify for the finals and Ridgewood was back in first for Craig Beckworth